Hey, what's up, everybody? Scott with the Barricade Startup. We're going to get it going today, okay? Sorry, coffee's still kicking in. Getting the cobwebs out of my head. I worked late last night. I'm sore. Man, I'm sore. Like, usually you think you get over soreness, but I haven't been able to kick it. Like, this whole entire time. Usually by noon, my body starts working. But let me show you guys what I've done so far and what we got today back in the old food truck. Y'all remember this coffee truck? Anyway, so got the cash drawer mounted. It's not going anywhere. This is where my square register will sit. Uh, this is the reader that will go outside uh, for customers to use. Uh, let me see what else we got going in here. My, my bottle holder. Oh, isn't that beautiful? Isn't that beautiful, people? Yes, it is. And then, let's see if I measured it right. There should be seven or eight that go across here. I think it's eight. Oh, anyway, I have to remeasure it. Uh, there's where the sauces go. Right, we're going to pull that out today, clean behind it, make sure that's all good. Put that back. We got to clean and mop, sweep, mop everything in here. There's the, the very contentious ice machine. God forbid we make our own ice. City's keeping us safe. I will take that fight. I promise you I will take that fight as far as I have to. Because that's ridiculous. They work for us. Are you going to remind them? But yeah. That's the way I work. The government doesn't just say stuff. And I go, okay, yeah. Whatever you say, you very wise government. It's usually no logical reason behind what they say or do. I mean, sometimes there is, and I ask for a logical reason. I say, what's the logical reason for me being able to use my ice machine that's using potable water approved by the city that goes through that and that and goes straight to there. But somehow, there's a problem with that. Not sure why, but they thought this out. And they're reading off a piece of paper. And God forbid they have to think past that. So anyway. That's what I got going on today. I got some other errands to run. But basically, I'm going to finish all the little checkpoints on there. And then I'm going to make the city give me an answer. So we can hopefully get open tomorrow. Because and every day, it's just costing me money. And I'm not making anything. Well, let me tell you. That's the hard part. Whenever it goes, let's say... When are people like, when do you plan on opening? Uh, like a month ago. <laughs> so yeah, um, that will definitely mess with cash flow when you have not opened. Um, but we are going to get open. We're going to get open very soon. It's very close. I'm getting excited. If I could mess with this camera, so quit jacking with the lights. Do have some other errands to go run this morning, uh, but the truck is the main focus. We are going to get it done cleaned up I gotta clean windows just wipe it all down let's make it look pretty uh, put the fatigue mats in of course this is my <laughs> this is my uh, water reservoir for gray water out of the espresso machine which they have to specially approve who knows if they will uh, yes yeah, just a kitty litter thing I painted but also see I put that magnet back there I had to figure out a way to keep it from moving around, this is the, the what I came up with. This is the hose that goes into it. Let's see if it works. In real time, I see it doesn't have to be like super strong, but it just needs to hold it. That's at least holding it. I may have to add to it, but hell, that's working. All right, I like it. So you just got to come up with solutions. You got you got issues. You got to come up with solutions. That's it. You just got to get creative with it. That's what it's all about. Entrepreneurship. But uh, yeah, it's fun. I'm getting excited. A little bit nervous. I mean, I don't care how many times I've opened a business. It's always nerve wracking. You never know. You just never know how people are going to accept you. Having everybody's asking me, "Where are you going to be? Where are you going to be?" Well, I'm still trying to figure that one out. I've already asked for a couple places, and uh, I was told no. I'm like, well, there's already food trucks going over there. But, of course, they again, they would have to think, and they didn't want to go that far. So, anyway, 
that's the scoop that's what we're doing today we're gonna to get this done I'll make a video this afternoon showing what all I've done and uh, until next time see you guys